Hi, Prosperity Team. It's Dr. Money, and I'm coming to you from the Prosperity Corner of the Universe. And you know where the Prosperity Corner of the Universe is? It's wherever you are. My Prosperity Corner of the Universe is right here, and your Prosperity Corner of the Universe is right where you are. But we forget that, or we don't even know it in the first place. There's somewhat like three stages in this prosperity consciousness. The first one is when we're totally asleep. We have no idea that we can make any changes in our lives at all, that we're at choice, that our thoughts have a vibrational frequency. We don't know any of that. You know, the vibrational frequency that has a very uh, attractive nature is positive thinking, but we don't know that. But we begin to ask that question, and that is, is that all there is? So we begin to wake up, and we begin to wake up to possibility, to choices. And this is where affirmations come in. And affirmations, it, it doesn't matter. It's not that we're trying to believe an affirmation, uh, even though it's best if we can couch an affirmation in a way that we can believe it by putting uh, a, some kind of a, a prefix on our affirmation that would be something, a qualifier, that would be something like, I would like to believe that I'm prosperous. E even if we just say that, we can certainly agree with that. So in this second phase of prosperity, we're doing the work. We're clearing our mind. We're trying to settle the mind down because the third place, space of place in prosperity is just when we feel okay. We feel safe and protected, and we have a trust knowing that we will be able to attract what we need when we need it. So we move through these phases of prosperity. So that's what we're talking about on the uh, Abundance Affirmations page and in, in being in the prosperity team. My idea is that if we form a consciousness in this uh, prosperity team, then we can do more with our consciousness together than we could do alone. So I want to talk, uh, I pulled out some affirmation cards that I thought I'd share with you. These are some that I um, have been carrying around for quite some time. Um, my friend Edwin Gaines, a wonderful prosperity teacher, has many, many kinds of prosperity projects. So I pulled out some ones that I thought you would really like. And I'm just, just relax, take a few deep breaths, and listen to these prosperity affirmations and so as I'm going to be saying these in the I but of course as you breathe them in you breathe them in using the I tense no nothing and no one can withhold my prosperity that is kind of a takeoff on Catherine Ponder's affirmation there is no person place or situation that can stand in the way of my prosperity and I think Catherine Ponder's was a takeoff from Emma Curtis Hopkins so these ideas go through different people and they change a little bit so you want to make the affirmation for you or use this particular affirmation I am truly thankful for all the good I already experience. Well, that's a perfect thing to start thinking about this Thanksgiving season. I am truly thankful for all the, the good I already experience. I am a being of integrity and I love myself a lot. Now, if you've been around for a long time with prosperity, we know that as we raise our self-esteem, we actually raise our income because if we don't think we deserve it or we, we think we're bad people, then we're not going to reward ourselves or attract good things into our lives. I am joyful, peaceful, healthy, enthusiastic, wise, loving, and rich right now. That's a pretty neat one. I am joyful peaceful, healthy, enthusiastic, wise, loving, and rich right now. I prosper everyone and everyone prospers me. I prosper everyone and everyone prospers me. The entire universe supports my dreams, ventures, and projects. Ah! The entire universe supports my dreams, projects, and ventures. I changed the wording a little on that. I am courageous and I speak words of truth and power. I am courageous and I speak words of truth and power. Rich divine ideas flow through me and bless and prosper all humankind. Rich divine ideas flow through me 
and bless and prosper all humankind. This is what the little cards look like. Let's see if we can focus that there. Yeah. I am one with all the good in the universe. I am one with all the good in the universe. Now there are a couple, there are many ways to use affirmations, but one way is to just take an affirmation and meditate with it, contemplate it, and imbibe it. That's that's more like the way the mystic does something. It doesn't try to get through a bunch of information, but it tries to gain or gather all the sweetness, all the juice, all the revelation from one small thought. So you can do your prosperity affirmations any way you'd like. I, I like to read them as if they're poetry. These poetries just feed my heart. They feel sweet and they feel gentle and kind. And I like to feed my, work, my mind with kind thoughts. So that's just a few ideas about affirmations today. And I hope you had a good day and that you will remember for sure that I love you. Now I'm going to make a pumpkin pie from a real pumpkin. <laughs>